Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. I trust you guys are doing well. Um, I'm back here and if you're somebody who follows my channel and follows my Instagram, then you might know a little bit about what this new video is about. So this is a new segment, not new to my blog, but very, very much new to the channel. This is the segment which we're going to call Life in Photos. Now, if you're a diehard OG, uh, fan favorite of my blog then you would know about the life and photo segment basically what happens is i collect six pictures from a certain month throughout that month six of my favorite pictures and i put them in a collage and i basically explain them to you uh the reason why i started this segment on my blog is because i love to look at people's pictures but not only look at them um also try to figure out what was the story behind it so the reason why i put the segment up on instagram first is because i wanted some of my subscribers to be part of the segment as well so for me this is like a giving back saying thank you to you um and featuring you on the channel yes featuring you on the channel so what i asked is for um some of you guys to go through my instagram timeline pick some of your favorite pictures and send them through to me dm them through to me and i will explain what the story is behind that picture and give a little bit of information about the subscriber themselves so pretty much you just pick a picture that you like of mine that you would like to know the backstory of and then you send it through to me and I discuss it on the video and I talk about the subscriber who sent through the picture so this is going to be ongoing it's going to be once a month so anytime when you feel like oh my gosh I like that picture DM me that picture and if I pick it I'll come back to you and I'll ask you what do you want me to say about you on my channel that's pretty much how easy it is super super easy so we're gonna get started because uh there's a lot to get through but um the first the, the set the collage the six set six piece collage that i am going to be discussing is on here this will feature on my blog as well as in this video and what this collage is about is um I took some of my favorite pictures I can't find it on my phone now I took some of my favorite pictures um, over the December period and I put them together and I put them in a collage so I'm gonna explain those and then get on to the subscriber portion of this video so let's get started as you can see the collage is here and we're gonna go clockwise starting from the first picture the first picture as you can see is a picture of me and my best friend Dineo and we were doing a toast basically it was just after i had moved into this place we had just unpacked the last boxes and you know said you know what this would be an opportune time to toast i mean it's a new spot we did the most we're so exhausted but let's toast to it so that's what we did we toasted and we took a picture and she's been there through all my moves um i've stayed in like four places through all my moves she's been there so it was one of those things where we're just like kin, kin, let's do a toast the next picture in the next frame from that one is this this is basically what you see here um i get asked a lot of questions about this background and could you do a room tour could you do a desk tour what i will do is a desk tour i don't think i'll do a room tour uh for certain reasons but me and my sister are going to sit down and discuss that in a video uh for you guys to understand but chances are i might be moving again so i won't have enough time to deco up this place for you guys and do a room tour but i will definitely do a desk tour and explain the frames behind me and all that jazz but basically the picture that i took there in the second frame is this from a certain angle the next frame is a picture of my favorite water bottle at this time and i get that water bottle from hip it's no the brand is hip and the store is at home stores a lot of people have asked me like where do you get this from and i've tagged them in instagram so that you guys can see that i get it from at home stores but the most important thing about that picture is the 
ACV and I get asked so many questions about where I get asked on my Instagram and I get asked in videos where do you buy that ACV this is the Bragg's ACV and you can purchase it from Discam stores that's the only place that I know where you can get it I get the big one and it lasts me maybe about two months or something like that because ACV is quite pricey it's very expensive the small one is about 120 rand so that big one is I don't know maybe around the 200 300 rand mark but it lasts me about two months so I love that one and I started taking ACV when I was uh, intermittent fasting when I started intermittent fasting and yeah I've been I've been taking it since I will have a video on intermittent fasting so I'm not gonna get into that one now the next picture after that are my sandals which I've been asked about as well these sandals I purchased from country road around December time early December um, and they are leopard print sandals with the faux fur skin like they are so beautiful they're so beautiful um, and my sister my younger sister Hania seems, seems to love them so much I feel like I'm racing through this video we're mm -hmm. not talking very quickly yeah um, so yeah those are my favorite sandals at the moment I don't wear them every day they're quite fancy so I wear them when I go out and things like that but I love 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 those sandals country road and trinary for me have trinary have beautiful beautiful sandals um, the next shot is a breakfast shot. Now this, I get asked about, yo, I need to start charging people for my breakfast. I need to start making sure that people pay for my breakfast. Even this morning, somebody said to me that, wow, this was nice. Like it's just a, it's, it, it even when to me, it's just the most basic breakfast. <laughs> Delicious. So in that picture, I had made a slice of toast, low GI toast, uh, a little bit of avocado, uh, some prosciutto and um, what's this, uh, eggs, scrambled eggs on top and that was it. But yes, I'm going to start charging for my breakfast because I, I mean, me, I can't. It was a delicious breakfast, that one. Topped it off with sriracha sauce, which I love. I love sriracha sauce. Topped it off with that. The last frame is me giving my little sister Hanya a kiss on Christmas Day. If you have seen the Christmas vlog, then you will tell by what we're wearing that it was taken on Christmas Day. I didn't realize that the picture was being taken, but evidently Hanya was because she was just like looking all cute as she normally is. But yeah, we took that picture on Christmas Day. I mean, for me, I love that picture. It shows, showcases a lot of emotion between me and the kid. Um, and there is a lot of emotion between the two of us. So I love that picture. Love, love, love it. So that's a rundown of my collage of my life in photos. Now we're going to move to the subscriber portion. And I picked three subscribers and people who are part of the JK family. Um, the first one I'm going to put right here and this is a picture that was taken by Dudu K. She took a screenshot and she sent it to me and she said tell me the story. Tell me why you're smiling in this picture, right? So that's a picture that was taken on one of my shoots and um, I have a wonderful friend, a very very good friend of mine uh, who happens to also take pictures of me when she feels like it. Sometimes even when we're at lunch she'll take pictures of me. But on that day we were actually on a shoot and um, Dudu wanted to know what's the backstory behind it. We were at an office block, office park somewhere in Santon and we jumped in there and I had a stylist who was styling all my clothes that day who also happens to be a very good friend of mine. I'll attach everybody's information below. And the time when this shot was taken, I was smiling because uh, the, the, the creative director who happens to be sitting in the chair in this room right now, he's, he's right here, he's right here. He was trying to get me to smile and pull certain faces and then Awonke would click the shots. And so he got me to smile and she got that shot and it, it happened to be one of my favorite shots at the time. Um, this is Dudu K. If you want to follow her, she's great. She's beautiful. She's just awesome on so many levels. Her Instagram profile feed thing is a tip. It's so beautiful. It's just like, ah, ah, ah. But yeah, definitely give her a follow. I'll put down her details below as well. If And she's good on skin. Oh my God, her skin is glass. Okay. The next photo that I'm going to put up is a picture that I was sent by Maxine. And now, let me get into Maxine. This is Maxine. This is what Maxine looks like. Isn't she gorgeous? She's beautiful. She's 
she's beautiful right uh, Maxine is a friend of mine and um, she wanted to know what the backstory is behind this picture let me pull it up so I can see it on my phone but you guys are gonna see it here so basically it's a comparison from a picture that I took three years ago to a picture that I took I think last year or maybe late the year before um, and it was just me um, just it, <sighs> Just being cognizant of how much my body has changed over the years and I was I was I was happy when I wrote down that Instagram blog post I was um, it was for me it was quite shocking to see that my body had changed that much all because I chose to start eating healthy and start living healthy and start being aware and cognizant of what I put in my f stomach and um, and because of that, because of that change, and because of, I implemented that change in my life, I then, then the weight just came off. For me, it was initially to try and get healthier, uh, but then the weight came off and I've never felt better. Maxine also asked a couple of questions. Uh, she says, how, how I want to know how you feel. I feel great. There's days where I don't feel too great. There's days where I feel phenomenal. There's days where um, and when I don't feel too great, it's because I've been eating rubbish. Meaning around the December time, I have been eating rubbish. Uh, but most days I feel really good. I'm happy. I love the way looking at myself in the mirror. I love taking pictures because I don't feel like this side is this side and this side is this side. I actually feel really really good for the most part. So I really really um. I'm, I'm much happier now with my body and with the way that I'm eating um, and ever since intermittent fasting things have just become better so I'm happy there um, how has this journey impacted your life and how have you changed as a result of it I've just become a happier person I think when I was at my heaviest I was very unhappy clothes were tight I wasn't feeling happy in anything that I was wearing I was upset most of the time crying at the fact that I wasn't pretty and this and that and the other and when I did this change where I started eating healthily and what have you and I dropped the weight and I changed my hair I I changed everything and it's put me I've never felt more comfortable in my skin I'm saying that Look, I'm not taking away from the fact that there are certain days where I feel like crap and it's probably because I ate a, 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 a burger the night before or whatever. So when I wake up the following morning, I'm like, why did I eat that burger? Why did I eat that pasta? But it's not every day. Most days I feel absolutely great. I love how it really has changed my life for the better in terms of physically how I feel about myself, mentally how I feel about myself. It's definitely changed it. What prompted the change to begin with definitely i was feeling sluggish tired going up a flight of stairs and just like, <sighs> you know you're just you're tired you 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 just uh, your clothes don't look right um you eat something and you just feel like i just i just you know that meme or that that gif with that little kid just that like, i'm gonna nap right here i'm just gonna nap right here i was feeling like that a lot of the time and i was like this can't be healthy so i hope that answers everything maxine is one of my friends as i said she's got a youtube channel and she pretty much we do similar videos we do beauty we do makeup we do uh skin she has story times very very similar to my channel so definitely if you enjoy my channel just pop into maxine's channel Tell her I sent you, say hi, subscribe, follow her, all that jazz. Okay, now we're going to move on to the last picture is here. And this picture was chosen by Lloyd. Lord. Actually, his name is Andile Similani, but his, um, his Instagram uh, account, his Instagram name is Lord underscore Similani. So basically, he was asking uh, what... What's the deal with the this picture right here? And this picture right here was taken in Zanzibar. Went to Zanzibar in 2015 with my best friend and a lady and her best friend, the four of us, and we stayed at this amazing place. Uh, the place is called Diamond Star of the East. Google it. Oh my God. Oh my God. It's just basically villas and we were staying in a villa and yeah, you know, own private pool. We had a butler. Uh, we had breakfast served. At, uh, at our villa every morning or if we wanted to eat it somewhere else we could we had our own private beach oh my god <gasps> it was a lot 
it was the most exciting most lavish trip i've ever been on like the butler was 24 hours okay and there was a time where i actually got really sick and uh really sick that they had to call out a doctor and um i i buzzed the butler at like 1 a.m and within five minutes he had his entry into the villa and he was in there and he was like ma'am how can i help you i'm like i need a doctor but i was i was quite sick -ish. but um for the most part uh it was a really 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 a uh, great trip and that's how the picture was taken and that's the backstory behind that picture I was sitting there on that day bed. my friend Masawata decided to take the picture and yeah that was it if you want to follow Andile Andile has a YouTube channel as well and he basically vlogs and follows his you follow along with his life as a college student so definitely check it out if you're somebody who's in college you might enjoy all of that this is Andile right here I'll put down his details below and yeah that's pretty much it this is how life in photos is going to go i hope you guys have enjoyed this video i'm gonna go now and take a little bit of a break and have a kit kat not a kit kat but have a break and i'll see you in the next life in photos going to be doing one of these once every month so if you come across a picture of mine that you like definitely send 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 it to me dm it to me screenshot it and who knows you might be the next subscriber that i feature on my channel okay okay if you like the segment let me know down below comment subscribe join the jk family uh this is just my way of of just appreciating you guys by featuring you in a standard segment in uh my videos so hope you enjoy it i'll see you in the next video i need to calm down my mouth is feeling a lot and i'll see you in the next video bye